We're here in Framingham at the Framingham History Center celebrating Flag Day with one of the earliest flags in Framingham, possibly the earliest. Uh, this is a flag that was carried by the 13th Regiment in the Civil War and uh, it was, the money was raised for this flag by George Brown who was a Framingham resident, worked with a Boston firm and after the Civil War with the dedication of the Edgell Memorial Library building, he donated this flag to the, to the town to be stored and displayed in this building. After several years um, in the Memorial Hall downtown, we're very happy to have it back here at the Framingham History Center. It was members of the Framingham Historical Society who had the flag pulled out of a corner of the building in a little cubby hole where it was stored and had it restored. So we're, we're inviting you to come and see it here on Sunday on Flag Day. So this flag uh, was carried by Civil War soldiers to the Battle of Antietam, Gettysburg, Fredericksburg, and Bull Run and other battles as well. Um, it was uh, restored for the town's true centennial in 2000 and it was then hung at the Memorial Building until uh, just a month ago when we had an open house here at the Edgel Memorial Library. And now that the roof has been repaired on this building, we're beginning to bring treasures like this flag back and we're opening the building to the public to come and see these treasures more. So this flag can now be seen by the public and it, it um, here in the building where it lived for over a hundred years. We will be having an open house on Sunday, Flag Day, from 3 to 4.45 uh, and people can come and see what we believe is the oldest existing U.S. flag in Framingham and if anybody has an older flag we would love to hear about it. Thank you.